Hey girls, it's Mariah and thanks for coming back for another Mariah's Monday Makeover. Well, it's actually the Friday before you're getting this video, but I was going through the trunk show that's here this weekend and I was just so inspired that I thought I would kind of take one of the trends that I see coming out and talk to you a little bit about it. And actually one of the trends is neon. Now, Alberto Macaulay is a collection that we just got in. I'm wearing a great little lace cardigan. There's a gorgeous pink blouse. And it's this neon color is just so fun. Now, I get that, you know, it's definitely a trend, it's something that's going on in fashion right now, but this is just such a great way to kind of brighten up and wake up your wardrobe. You're going to pair it with easy neutrals like navy blue, like black, like white of course in the spring, um, but it's just a really fun, happy, vibrant color collection that I think would be a great addition to any wardrobe. Well, as I was going through Joseph Ribkoff, I noticed that they even had the influence of some of the neons too, so I thought I would flash a couple just to kind of show you the different ways that this kind of neon fluorescent trend is popping up. So the honeycomb fabrication is probably one of their biggest trends of the season for Ribkoff, and this is such a great kind of punchy green. Again, they grounded it with a great black, so black skirt, black pants, it's still fun, but you're getting that pop. This was another great wrap dress that I thought I would show too. Um, again, really kind of a neon glow in the dark green. They grounded it with navy blue, so that's simple and easy, right? And this is another one, this kind of key lime color that popped in. Again, it naturally gives you just a little bit of glow, it kind of brightens up our complexion, brightens up our wardrobe. I love this little ladder sleeve. So really fun pieces that are popping up in Ripkoff. Now also I um, have a little bit in the corner there, some um, gorgeous cashmere again and these fun, edgy colors that I just love. Well, this is a great example of a perfect neon piece to add to your closet. And what I thought I would do really quickly is show you a couple different ways to kind of put this piece into your wardrobe. Now, the first way um, is just really a loose, untucked silhouette. Now, what you might not be able to see is I've just paired it with a really clean, simple, black, straight skirt. So you can easily do kind of unstructured and then a really structured skirt, right? The other great part you can do, and I'm just gonna style this really quickly, is you just simply tuck in the blouse. The tucking is definitely coming back. And you say, ooh, Mariah, I have a little tummy, I don't know, and I don't usually tuck in. Tucking in a blouse can really work great because what you can do is blouse it out just a little bit. Again, that's gonna create a little camouflage through the tummy area. And if you're still worried, or maybe the fluorescent is maybe a little bit, you know, too much color for the office or whatever, what I'm gonna do is just put a really crisp tailored jacket over it. Now what you've created is almost kind of like a, a suit silhouette, but again, you're just getting that little touch of pink, so if you kind of need to ease into this colorway, this is a great way to do this. You could always do a skinny belt if you want to, you know, and again, once you're ready to go out to dinner, you can untuck all this, grab your favorite pair of white jeans or white capris, and look how pretty that's gonna be against the white for spring and summer. Now, for my wild card girls, the printed pant is really big. So look at this cute little polka dot pant from Ribkoff. And couldn't you have so much fun with that? So it's just happy and it's fun. Neon is not meant to be taken seriously, so it's just something that you're gonna add to your wardrobe and just play with it. So I hope you guys had fun learning a little bit about neon and how to add it into your wardrobe, and we'll see you guys at G. Loretta this week.